Some are getting ready for even possible flooding. ABC 10's Monica Coleman is in Pollock Pines with more. Driving up Highway 50 to Pollock Pines, visibility is low. Snow blankets the treetops and roads wait to be plowed. Crazy. <laughs> That's how little Anthony describes the snowstorm. He has been out of school for over a week and was beside his mother Tuesday, stir crazy and ready to get out of town. We haven't been able to get out um, by car, so we've been able to have to take the bus. Mom April says it's been hard dealing with the cold when snow surrounds your home piling up over five feet. We live down in, down in a hole, so it's hard to get out. Sometimes all you can do is just walk out. Trying to get out of town on 50, some have crashed into snow embankments like this Honda tipped over on two wheels, getting dug out by a snow plow. We stay open for the community. We want to be here in case of those people have emergencies. When there's snow on the ground like this, a lot of people run chains and then chains break, especially big rig mm -hmm. chain. And those chain links go through tires mm -hmm. like mad. A little snow is good for business, but a lot of snow is bad, says Travis Beckett, manager of Sierra Nevada Tire and Wheel. But he's making the best of it and lending a helping hand to his employees who may be stuck in the snowy powder mess. I've picked up employees too mm -hmm. that want to come to work, like that but can't get out. So I've gone around and picked them up. So we make it work as best we can.